I have no idea who you are. This is his wife of 19 years. Yeah. I'm you can't see his wedding ring? Well, he told me, you told me that you... He told me that y'all had some sort of arrangement made. No, the arrangement is, is I have stage four cancer and he's my caregiver and I stay home a lot and I'm finding out that you have extracurricular activities you're not telling me about. Sorry, I just, I've been lonely and bored at home and I didn't sign up for all this. Patrick, do you think I signed up for cancer? Really? I'm bored and I'm at home alone and all I do is wait for you to come home and you haven't been coming home. I so there was no arrangement? Myself. No, there's no arrangement at all. I think he completely lied to you. What did he tell you exactly? That, they, that, she, that she knew about this, that, that she had told him to go on with his life and he's supposed to, you know, that he was just supposed to take care of her, bring her medicine and... Now, this man is disrespectful on all levels, fam. Enough is never enough, and this definitely was not enough for him. It wasn't enough that his wife was sick. It wasn't enough that she had ill, you know what I'm saying? She got an illness going on, you know, cancer and whatnot. You had to go out and make a whole nother relate. It's like, bro, that's ridiculous, fam. You probably could have just came to her like, hey, I want to add another woman to the situation. She probably would have rejected it, but she would have known where your heart was. But you being a liar dog nobody can trust you now now bro you get into the next relationship or you get back into this relationship and things gonna be rocky until they know more you feel what i'm saying it's like bro y'all gotta understand something bro when you confess with your mouth what you actually desire you know what i'm saying a person is much more willing to be open-minded if you come to them now, I'm not saying that they will be open minded in general and they will accept it, but this is not acceptable at all. You know what I'm saying? You've made it about you and your selfish behaviors and what you wanted, trying to manipulate the situation, make it about you. Oh, I'm so I'm bored and I'm it, do it. I don't care about none of that, dog. We don't care about none of that. Be a man and and and, and uphold your uh the things that you signed up for, fam. You're talking about some, I didn't sign up for this, bro. Didn't you marry her for better or for worse? You signed up for it, dog. You signed up for it. Be a man. You know what I'm saying? Be a man, bro. Ain't nothing wrong with it. It's nothing wrong with it, dog. Like I said, had you came to her and was like, hey, I want to be in a poly relationship, she probably would have been like, okay. You know what I'm saying? Considering the, the 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 stage that I'm in right now, you know what I'm saying? Not saying that you should utilize that to your advantage at all. I'm not saying that. But I am saying even before then, you probably, you was thinking about this before then. Because if you wasn't, this wouldn't have transpired within itself. You feel me? Because like, bro, like I said, bro, that's disrespectful, dog. You don't value her, your relationship, nor your marriage. You know, and for that, bro, you know, there you got to suffer the consequences. There's repercussions to things like that. And to think that there aren't, bro, you in a hole, you living in a fantasy, dog. You living in a fantasy, bro. We are not, we don't move like this as alpha males. We do not. We come to our woman, tell her, tell her what it is. And we move up on, up, blah, 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 blah. I'm getting tongue tied. We come to our woman, tell them what it is. And we move on with our day, you know. Not this. This is Clowns R Us, and this is not acceptable, bro.